Happy New Year and Merry Late Christmas! Hope you all had a wonderful set of holidays! Given how most of my holiday season is either centered around work or going all the way back to my hometown, I thought we had some fun and unpack my gifts. Some of my gifts I had to leave at home, silly me, only brought one suitcase. Beyond the obligatory clothes, which are strangely are a lot more appealing as I get older, food and snack items, as well as Pokemon cards I'll be showcasing in a separate video, here is what I managed to bring home that isn't an item too personal for me to showcase. First off, a meat thermometer. I know what you're thinking. Asina, why did your family give you a meat thermometer? You'll have to stay tuned for the future to find out that answer, unfortunately. Next are a few small items from my grandmother when I was but a wee orca who call me Ladybug. Seriously though, did anybody else have these little dudes as a kid? She got me a couple nutcrackers, a running theme every year between us, especially giving her a growing collection. And no, these are not re-gifts. Trust me, I checked. Next up, Dragon Central. I was definitely a Wings of Fire's kid, and my love and collection of dragons only grows with each year. I know this looks like a shoebox, trust me, it'll make sense soon. This baggie was the same grace so I could keep most of my breakable things together in a cushion of bubble wrap. Seriously though, look at how adorable these boogers are! I had no idea where my parents find these, but I love them to death, they are absolutely precious. Ah, told you the shoebox would make sense. Sure, it's a bit beaten up, but my folks got a steal on this a whole quarter for this magnet dragon shoe. And yes, I am definitely thinking of some ideas to have these shoes actually made so I can cosplay them eventually. Onto the stocking stuffer side of things, they also got me these cute, adorable little acrylic keychains. Not sure where I'm gonna hang them up though quite yet, but I'm sure we'll figure that out together. Up next is my family's latest craze, and that is diamond art. And yes, all of them are in fact dragon themed. Speaking of, however, as more of a chill stream, would you be interested in hanging out while doing these together over on Twitch with me? Leave a comment down below, or recommend what you would like to see me stream this year. Lastly, from the family side is cornhole boards, but for quarters. Honestly, I think these are great and just bring back fond memories of playing cornhole with my fam while camping. Over on my friend's side, look at this stinking cute monstrosity! It's a fucking adorable! On a local store, my roommate saw me eyeing this up and got it for me, and uh, gosh dang it, I gotta thank him so much for it. Last but certainly not least is a Meowster can sticker that I use as a bookmark for my plane ride. My friends definitely see me as the monster addicted cat lover, don't they? Thank you for checking out my video, and hey, what did you get for Christmas? Let me know down below, hit that sub button and notification bell, and I'll see you all in the future. Orca Dorka!